please ignore my hair I'm getting it done tomorrow it looks like I've been dragged through a hedge backwards hello or welcome to my channel today we are going to do a TK Maxx haul it was going to be a Matalan one Matalan was terrible so we have chosen TK Maxx I got some jumpers I got some accessories I got some home stuff too I'm just going to show you them all on so you can see my main thing about this video is that I've tried to make it a bit autumny Basically, I hate autumn. I hate every season other than summer. I, I'm freezing all the time. I feel like I feel the cold way more than others. So I've decided I'm gonna finally embrace the other seasons and try and make myself feel a bit excited about autumn or fall if you're American. So I've got some orange, red and berry candles. The orange ones from TK Maxx. I've got a big cozy jumper and I've got my coffee and uh, we're gonna get into the video. So jumpers, 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 can't get enough of them with this weather. So this is a jumper from Yes Lola, that's the, the brand name, 14.99 in a small, and I've never felt such a soft jumper. Thanks Beth. When I put this on, it was just so luxurious. I was like, I'm getting it no matter what it looks like on me. It was really, really nice. So I'll show you what this looks like on. This is the jumper. Made me pair it with some Uggs. I just wish you could feel this because it's just like so silky, so nice. And yeah, just tucked it in there. That's the full length of the jumper, but I think I do prefer it tucked in. Then I've got a Bershka jumper, don't you know? Very posh. Um, Bershka's one of those shops that you walk past when you're like shopping in Manchester or London and you just think I've got to get to River Island or I've got to get to New Look and you just kind of miss it but I do think oh I would like to wear something from Bershka so this is only 5 99 it's a pretty simple bog standard jumper but it's blue and I don't have any blue jumpers so I'm really happy with that oh, I just think this looks so bougie like hey my Bershka jumper I need to stop doing that this is just really nice, like it feels nice. The only thing with this jumper is it's static. So instantly your hair is gonna fly in the air, but you could maybe wear a vest top underneath to try and stop that happening maybe. Love the fit of this and I can't believe the price, it's so good. Then I was well excited about this, Hollister in TK Maxx. I've never spotted any Hollister in TK Maxx. This is luxurious, it's that Hollister feel. Do you know when you walk in Holliston you can't see and then you just feel this jumper and you're like, oh my God, I don't care what it looks like, I can't see it anyway, so I'll just buy it and guess. It's like that, it's really like cashmere feel. And it was 14 99 so it was pretty, you know, on the expensive side of TK Maxx, but I really love how this looks on. You can tell the difference with the quality with this Hollister jumper. It's just so luxurious. And the only thing that's annoying me is that it's so short. Oh, I just hate it when like, you know when you lift your hands up and then your stomach's just like out and you may be like outside and it could be freezing. So I may put a vest top under this, but it was worth it for me for the style and how luxurious it felt. Then this is from Natural Concept, STR, whatever that is. And this is 5 99 and again, a really cheap jumper. It's nice to be nice, so let's be nice. Just cute, and it's very tracksuit-y material. Something you would chuck on as loungewear. It's really soft, actually, like, nice material. Oh, it's it's Stradiva Stradivarius. I've never known how to say that. Stradivarius? I don't know. I'm not like, all right. Div if I get that wrong. That's gonna be tried on. This just says autumn for me, the color and just the fact that it's a really nice chilled out laid back jumper nice little slogan the only thing is with it it is really thin so it probably will just be a house jumper or i will layer it up massively but yeah like it and then the last clothing item is this going out top right this is really different for me for anyone i think and it's green snake print um it's got a little tie up thingy i'll show you when it's on and I just thought it looked so different to anything that I would usually wear. And I need to start wearing stuff that I don't us I wouldn't usually wear. Um, again, Stradivarius. Fashion trends made with love. 
and it is 5 99 Can't go wrong. I really like it. I've just noticed it's got a hole in it though. Really small one, but I think I might have done that. Um, yeah, it's just so different. Look, I mean, it's got a bit of elastic at the back, which is annoying me because it's pulling itself up my back, but like for six quid, can't really go wrong. I really like that. And you can tie this however you like. It looks like a bit of a tie like this, actually. Hold on. There we go. It feels really nice. Very, very thin, but that's just like a meal sorted. If you're going out for a meal with your friends, you just shove the six quid top on with this leather skirt and you've got something sorted for barely any money at all. Then I went to the home section, which was really good. I just got this photo frame just because my other silver frame's broken. It was really cheap. I think it was 4 99 so I got that. It doesn't feel cheap. I know it's broken because you dropped it on the floor. Then I got this journal. I've been looking for a journal for absolutely ages, but I don't just want a notebook. I want something with quotes in it. Basically, writing down your passions, your goals, things that you want to do today, mindfulness, you know, just remind you to be grateful. It's like a little diary, yeah. I wanted more of a diary journal, and I think that's really nice quality. Uh, I need to find out. Why is everything under body and bath or mod box? That doesn't help. I feel like it might have been 5 99 so that's that's pretty good i'm happy with that so i can't wait to fill that in then lashes galore i didn't know how good tk maxx were for lashes have they just suddenly started stocking good ones because we've got this absolutely battered ardell natural lashes here but it's like 2.99 that is brilliant for lashes and then these are 1.99 look at these babies really nice so I'm excited to try those. Then just a few bits of cosmetics. I needed a new lip scrub. This was $3.99, so not the cheapest, but it's Dr. Pawpaw, which I know is a really good company. So you've got the top part, which is the scrub, and then under here is the balm. Then got some hand cream, just because, I don't know about you, but my hands and lips are shot at the moment. They just feel horrendous, dry, flaky horrible that was 3.99 by balance me which is a good brand and then lastly i got therapy range stress roll on and it says we recommend that you apply to your wrists every three to four hours it's got grapeseed peppermint and lavender oil in that so i just love putting that on before bed it helps me get to sleep because if you watch my 25 facts about me video you'd know i have night terrors we also have this soy candle, which was $7.99. And I just thought, if this isn't an autumn candle, then what is? It's by Arta de Gassa, and it's mandarin and mint. And I think soy candles are a bit better for you, for like breathing in the fumes. So that is hopefully going to make me enjoy autumn a bit more. And that was my TK Maxx haul. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please subscribe to my channel. You know the drill. Leave a comment, let me know what you liked best and give us a thumbs up, please. It will keep my channel going. Doing those things will help new people see me on the YouTube homepage, so that'd be really helpful. Thanks so much for watching. Enjoy your autumn. I'm going to get a hot chocolate and get cozy.